Hey everybody, your favorite guy here. Just kind of chatting you up a little bit, I guess. I had a chance to go out and fly about seven packs today. And the first two or three, I was doing a little bit of fine tuning. Uh, and after that, I just started flying. Because what I noticed, once I got everything uh, on the yaw axis kind of tuned in, meaning that it wasn't rocking around when I would you know, punch the throttle or drop the throttle. It just felt different. I've never flown a quad since I've been flying that does what you tell it to and nothing more. Usually they wobble all over the place and I have to correct and I've really, you know, my flying style, for a long time it just incorporated those corrections, especially if it got to where I knew what the quad was going to do at a point. Um, which I guess this sounds funny because most people would have done something about it, and I just flew. It's what I did. But now I'm flying a quad that does what you tell it to, and it just feels weird to not have to correct like that. So that's why right now it's really just stick time. I gotta get, you know, a couple more days in to really get my confidence up. But long and short, what I'm seeing here, and I think I know what the culprit is. What I'm seeing here is a really slow wobble or bobble, mostly on the roll axis, at least that's what I'm noticing. And I think what it is, is that eye's too high. Um, you can see it all over the place through this whole thing. You may or may not have noticed it already. Yep, that's my phone. That is my uh, message notification sound. It's awesome, right? Anyway. You can see it, it's rampant all over this video. If you want, in fact, maybe I'll go back and just do this. I'll put some little indicator in there every time it's happening. Just kind of throw something up in the lower right-hand corner. You know, a red dot or something. But other than that, this thing's really feeling solid. Just strange in my experience. So I guess I'm just going to be flying over the next couple days and trying to get used to it doing what I tell it to do, and then I can get used to uh, being much more comfortable not just flying through and near things, but actually maybe pulling off some mild maneuvers while I do it. So, thanks again for all your help, guys. I'd appreciate if you gave this item uh, one last look for me, and even if it's just for confirmation that, yep, roll eye is too high. Even pitch eye might be a little high, so... Talk to you guys soon.